And here we are with day 18. This was really fun. Texture paste, uh, some distress inks, um, black gesso, and acrylic paint. All right, day 18, let's dig right in. I just made some new texture paste, so that should work better. I'm going to put this stencil on here, on our little card, on our little page. Put texture paste in that stencil. Gorgeous. Turn it over and do the same thing at the top. If you haven't made this texture paste, it's the best. It is baby powder and Mod Podge and gesso. And you can add colors to it if you so desire by adding some acrylic paint. All right, I'm gonna dry that. So yesterday's page took way too long. So we'll see if this one won't be more simple. All right, I've got some black gesso here. I'm just gonna put that all over the card. With all the bumps and grooves, I did end up bringing my brush in to smooth that black gesso out. We're gonna let that dry. Now I do dry mine with a heat gun. So after it's heated, it needs to cool before I take the sandpaper to it because it's just too vulnerable when it's hot. It'll take everything down even too much for me. So I'm gonna let that little card cool and bring in my sandpaper. All right, we are relatively cool. I'm gonna bring in a coarse grit. This is an 80 grit sandpaper and I'm going to go in there and sand it down. Dust that guy off. I went around the edge with some sandpaper. <laughs> Look at those texture paste fingers. Love that. A little bit more here. All right, I'm going to bring in some Mermaid Lagoon. This is the Distress Oxide, which we know is chalkier than the Distress Ink. Blend that all in nice. Take the sandpaper back to it. Bring in the wild honey. Now this is a distress ink, not an oxide. The mermaid lagoon. Paper. I'm going to bring in some pink acrylic and my fun stencil and some hubby is in his studio. You can probably hear him. I think that that must be a drill. Anyway, I'm going to bounce some pink paint in through that stencil. And for the unveiling, oh yes. That is gorgeous. Let's have another splot up there. Wanna? Or at least part of one? Mm. We'll do that. This is one artsy house, I can tell you. He's out there in his studio. I'm in here in my studio. Hudson's avoiding both of us. Waiting for his walk. That is great. I'm going to take a stabilo around the edge, and there we have page 18. Ooh, it's on the back of that one. So go create, go play, go have fun.